clam? It's a long way down. I've never done it before. What if I can't do it? What if I fall off? We could head down to that smaller hill. It'll be easier. I felt that same way when I was skiing. You did? Yeah. I was so excited to go skiing for the first time. My daddy suggested I try sledding instead because skiing for the first time can be tricky. But I didn't want to sled. I wanted to ski. took us higher and higher and higher. I started to feel a little nervous. Come here, Caillou. Let's get your skis on. I got into my skis and couldn't wait to get started. Okay, Caillou, are you ready? Now, you need to bend your knees, but keep your back straight. That's very important for balance. Skiing is all about balance. Let's try going in a straight line first. All right now, Caillou, are you ready? <laughs> One, two, three. Go! I couldn't stay up and fell over. I was so upset. I'd waited so long to learn to ski. Then I noticed Rosie and Mommy a little ways down the mountain. They were sledding! Can I, Daddy? <laughs> of course, Caillou. You can learn to ski another time. We can start off slow. Okay, are you ready then, Caillou? Knees bent, shoulders square, get your balance. Off we go! I went so fast! It was the best thing ever! As soon as I reached the bottom, I ran up the hill to do it all over again. I didn't lose my balance and I got better and better. See, Clem, my daddy was right. I should have tried sledding to begin with. But maybe, after all I've learned on the sled, I will be next year. My daddy always says, never to run before you can walk. Let's try the smaller hill, and maybe you can do the big one next time. Hey, Caillou! Clem! Wait up! <laughs> Caillou was having lots of fun throwing snowballs in the park with Rosie. Watch out, Rosie! Here it comes! But he couldn't get his snowballs to stay together. Why isn't this working? He wanted so badly to join in on the <laughs> snowball fight. My snowballs keep breaking. You've just got to pack it nice and hard so that it stays together, like this. Daddy had made the snowballs stick together, and Caillou wanted to test it out for himself. <laughs> what do you say we try something else before we make Mommy into a snowman? Snowman. Oh, I know. Let's build a snowman. Yay, snowman. Oh, 
Oh, I want to make a snowman with a big carrot nose and button eyes. <laughs> First, we need to make the snowman's body, Caillou. Why don't you and Rosie collect some snow, and Daddy and I will find sticks for the arms. Yeah! Caillou and Rosie were enjoying collecting the snow for their snowman. Great work, Caillou. Now let's see if we can make a nice, big, round ball. Caillou wasn't sure how to make his snowman so nice and round. But then he had an idea. Oh, I know. We have to pack it together, just like the snowballs. Snowballs! That's right. It's just like making big, round snowballs. Big, round snowballs! The big snowman with the button eyes and the carrot nose made Caillou very happy. Look out! Suddenly, a sled came crashing into the snowman. Oh no! Our snowman! It was Leo. Caillou was sad that their snowman had fallen over, but he was happy to see Leo. Oh, hey Caillou! Leo, what are you doing here? I'm just trying out my new sled. Do you want to have a try? Sure. Mommy, Daddy, can I go play with Leo for a while? <laughs> of course, Caillou. Just be careful. Caillou couldn't wait to test out Leo's sled. So, it's really easy. You just get in and slide all the way down. Cool. The hill looked big and scary, and Caillou wasn't sure that he wanted to sled down it anymore. Don't worry, Caillou. Even if you fall, the snow is so soft that it won't hurt. Look! See? Doesn't hurt at all. I don't know, Leo. It's a long way down. Come on, let's do it together! Woohoo! Alright! Watch out, Caillou! <laughs> that was awesome! I told you it didn't hurt! <laughs> My snowman! <laughs> Caillou felt bad for knocking down the snowman. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rosie. I didn't mean to knock down your snowman. Hey, I know! Why don't we build an even bigger snowman? Bigger snowman? Yeah, and this one will be just for you! Yay! Big snowman! Caillou had had a great day playing in the snow, and he was happy to be with Leo and his family. I can't wait to play in the snow again! Oh! <laughs> Snowball fight! <laughs> Caillou and his family went to a tree farm to pick up this year's Christmas tree. What about this one, Daddy? It's so big! <laughs> it is very big, Caillou. Maybe a bit too big for the living room. Let's find one that's a little smaller. Oh, okay. What about the ones over here, Caillou? I'm sure we'll still find one that's lovely and green, and it'll look even better once you and Rosie have decorated it. I guess so. Hey. How about you pick out the last few decorations once we bought the tree? Yes, please, Daddy! What do you think of this one, kids? Tree! Tree! Rosie likes this one, Mommy. I think we should get it. Great! I'll go get someone to help me get this on the car, and you and Daddy can pick out the last few decorations. 
Oh, wow! Let's go, Daddy! Caillou ran into the store. There were so many things to see, he didn't know where to begin. Oh, Daddy! I don't know what to choose! There are so many amazing decorations! Well, we need some more tinsel, some new lights, and a star for the top of the tree. Why don't you pick what you like and put it in the basket? Hmm... Red? Blue? Gold? Silver? Daddy! What about gold and red? Great idea! These will look so nice with the tree. What about the lights? There are white ones, colored ones, and flashing ones. The flashing colored ones! They look amazing! They do, don't they, Caillou? Hmm, now we just need a star for the top. Can you see where they are kept? Caillou knew what the shape of a star looked like, so he looked around the store <gasps> until he saw one. There, Daddy! Caillou, you shouldn't run off like that, so I can't see you. I know you're excited, but you need to stay safe. Okay, Daddy. I'm sorry. That's okay. I just don't want you to get lost. I just saw this awesome star, and I really want it for the tree. Wow, that is nice. Let's get that one. I'm sure Mommy and Rosie will love it. Let's get these and head back to the car. A kind man helped Mommy and Rosie attach the tree to the top of the car. Caillou was excited to show all the decorations to Mommy and Rosie that he and Daddy had bought. Mommy! We bought all the decorations! Where is the tree gone? It's in that bag on top of the car to protect it for the journey home. Oh, wow! I can't wait to get it home and decorate it! Are we going now? Yes, Caillou. Let's go back. Would you like some hot cocoa when we get home, too? Oh, yes, please, Mommy! I know I would. Coco! And Rosie. <laughs> Caillou couldn't wait for Daddy to finish putting up the tree. He wanted to cover it in all the pretty decorations they had bought. Whoops! Oh, dear. Are you okay, Caillou? Yeah, I'm fro- <gasps> Gilbert! Silly cat! You can't put up the decorations! Watch out for the baubles! Oh, dear. What has happened here? You have got yourselves into quite a mess. I'm sorry, Mommy. Can we put the decorations on the tree now? That sounds like a great idea. Caillou helped put the colorful flashing lights around the tree, decorate with tinsel, and hang the baubles on the branches. <laughs> Even Gilbert lent a paw as well. Just the star on the top now. Would you like to do it, Caillou? Rosie should do it. What a good big brother you are, Caillou. Wow! It looks amazing! This is going to be the best Christmas ever! It was Christmas Eve, and Caillou was dreaming of all the wonderful toys he'd be getting on Christmas Day.
Caillou put on his winter clothes and rushed outside into the snow. Merry Christmas! Santa! Hello, Caillou. Wow! You know my name! That's my cat, Gilbert. Have you come to bring me my presents? That's exactly why I'm here. But I've run into a little bit of a problem. Poor old Rudolph here forgot to bring his scarf and has caught a cold. Without Rudolph's nose, I can't see where I'm going. Uh, at this rate, no one will get their Christmas presents. That's awful. Here, Rudolph, you can have my scarf. Grandma knitted it for me so it's nice and warm. <laughs> hey, that tickles. I think I've had an idea. Maybe you and Gilbert could help me deliver the presents. Really? That would be amazing! Great! Give me a moment. I've got just the thing. Here you go, Gilbert. Now you can light the way for us. Okay, Caillou, hop on board. We've got some presents to deliver. This is going to be great! Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! You make a great reindeer, Gilbert. With you showing us the way, we'll have the presents delivered in no time. <gasps> We're so high up! Okay, Caillou. Time to deliver the first present. I'll show you. Take my hand, Caillou. Ready? Ready! Ho, ho, ho! Wow, that was magic! Christmas magic! Thanks for helping me deliver all the presents, Caillou. I couldn't have done it without you and Gilbert. That was the best Christmas Eve ever! Rudolph says he's feeling much better after wearing your nice warm scarf. Merry Christmas, Caillou! 
Merry Christmas, Gilbert. Ho, ho, ho! See you next year! Merry Christmas, Santa! <sighs> Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, Caillou! Mommy, Daddy, you'll never guess what Gilbert and I did last night. We went on a sleigh ride with Santa. That sounds like an exciting Christmas dream, Caillou. It wasn't a dream. It was real. I'm sure it was, Caillou. Let's go downstairs and see all the presents Santa brought you. Presents! 